Hey guys, welcome back. It's Nurse Karma here, and today I wanted to talk to you guys about the Zika virus. If you guys haven't heard about it yet, you will now. Alright guys, so what is Zika? Zika is a viral infection that is spread through mosquitoes. And this actually has been around for quite a while, like since the 1940s. It started in Uganda, Africa. And um, it just came back recently with an outbreak that happened in Brazil. So the thing about Zika is that it can be spread um, if a mosquito bites an infected person and then bites someone else. It spreads like that. And it can also be spread sexually. Um, and what studies have found is that men can actually have um, the Zika virus in their semen for up to six months. Okay guys, so according to the CDC, we shed the virus within two weeks. Meaning that if a mosquito bites us, we are no longer a vector to society. We're not dangerous anymore of transmitting the disease. However, when it comes to sex, women should take precautions for up to eight weeks and men should take precautions for up to six months. So our biggest concern with the Zika virus is its implications in pregnant women. It can cause birth defects. So we wanna make sure that pregnant women take all precautions by using long sleeve shirts and pants. Um, we wanna make sure that you try to stay away from traveling to areas that are highly affected with the Zika virus, and most importantly, using bug repellent. So let's talk about signs and symptoms. I just want to let you guys know that most of the signs and symptoms are very mild. They don't require hospitalization and they do kind of reflect the signs and symptoms of dengue and it's because the same mosquito that causes dengue um, causes Zika as well. So signs and symptoms include general fatigue, um, headache, sweating, fevers, um, it can cause a rash all over the body and something that differentiates it from all the other uh, mosquito related diseases like dengue is the conjunctivitis. So check those eyes. <laughs> Alright guys, so I made this video with the best intentions for my soon to be mamas. Um, I want you guys to take all precautions, take it seriously, follow up with the CDC in order to see what the most up-to-date information is, and follow up also with the health department. This video wasn't created to freak you guys out, but just to make you aware. That's what nurses do. Alright guys, so with all my hippie love, signing out.